Hello everybody, welcome back into more Until Dawn, my name is Sin, this is going to be episode 2, and while I could recap the story, I think the game is going to do that for me. So, let's just hop right back in. Don't you guys think this is a little bit- Oh, come on, she deserves it. Hannah! What's going on? Where's my sister going? It was just a prank, Han. Oh yeah, there was that weird First thing off, that was I gotta following. say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. I really want to spend some quality time with each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for, for the sake of my sisters. I need to go find Sam. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. So I got moved to the back and next to Josh. That's how we met. Boom. Butterfly effect. Man, I feel like this mountain gets bigger every time I climb it. Oh, yeah? Jealousy. It feels the same to me. Josh, Hannah and Beth's brother. Complex, thoughtful, and loving. And he's Rami Malik. Come on, you grew up here. It probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. You got a spare million lying around, I, I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I, I think I left it in my other jacket. Whoops. Hey, gang. You guys get up here okay? <sighs> Could've done with some bellboys, but uh, hey. Can't get everything. Yeah, it was pretty easy. A little creepy though, I mean, it's really weird being back here. Okay, no yo, one yo, feels yo. You get things moving uneasy. up here or what? Yeah, man. Uh, gossip? Uh... How are you doing? You know, your sisters disappeared a year ago. Hey, you doing all right? I mean, I know it must be really tough without your sister. Stop. I just meant that- No, I know what you meant. You know, seriously, I'm over it. And I just I want us to have a good time, you know? Like we always. You stood. Damn it. This freaking thing. Okay, he's it's over iced. it. What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in. They're just all locked. There's gotta be like a window around the corner we can get like, get open or something. Wait a second. Are you saying we should break in? <laughs> I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey, not if I don't report you. <laughs> um, <laughs> Lead the way, coaches. Okay. Hi, Chris. Uh, unsettled. It's weird to be back. Let's be confident, you know. So, how are you doing? Good, but a little cold. I think I could use some time curled up by the fire. Yeah, that does sound pretty nice. Okay, I follow. Ashley was looking pretty hot today, right? Oh, oh. She's like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? Now I just want to rip that parka right off of her and make some <laughs> snow angels, right? The way these guys talk to one another. Um. Oh, I want to, like, protest for Chris's sake, but also... I don't want to make the guy who lost his sisters angry. No. Absolutely. When are you gonna take her to the bone zone? <laughs> like, that could ever happen. Come on, man. She practically spends her entire life with you as it is. Well, yeah, but we're like friends. Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? <laughs> you and Ashley alone at last. You've laid all the groundwork. You've been a perfect gentleman. Now, you come in for the kill. Uh, agree, disagree. 
Maybe you're right. You're a hunter, bro. No fear, no mercy. I mean, she won't even know what hit her. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, I got it. Jeez. Oh, why are you standing like that? So you were supposed to be walking away. I was into my parents' lodge, bud. I didn't say I had a plan. You sounded like you had a plan. I don't have a plan. You better remember, Cochise, or else you got four lovely ladies who are going to be freezing their buns off. And last time I checked, that's not a good way to get laid. Oh, shoot. Nobody likes cool buns. Let's just break a window, like one in a room you don't use. That way it doesn't matter if it gets cold. Uh, Josh, you got an axe missing. Do you know anything about this, buddy? Hey, Josh, you got an axe missing. Damn, I'm getting pretty low on juice here. I just had to turn off my GPS. I'm finally, like, outside, where I might actually use it. Well, 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 we got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. Oh, oh okay, we're moving it. Is the window unlocked? Okay, the window is unlocked. You all right, honey? I'm okay. Should have paid more attention in climbing class. You mean Jim? Yeah, you know, with the climbing up the rope. No one does that anymore, honey. Whoa. Did I do that? Unless I, you're I a psychic, so. no. Here, use this. Whoa, Chris, I just got an awesome idea. Yeah? Totally. What, what is it? Okay, so I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's, it, how's a stick of deodorant gonna help? Spray on. It's a can. Oh, yeah. Now I gotcha. Flamethrower. Just like we did with the little army dudes. Yep. Ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and whoosh. Bye-bye frozen lock. Bingo. All right, so you got this. I'm gonna go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, but I'll do it. Godspeed, Pilgrim. Okay, so we're gonna make a flamethrower and possibly burn the door and start a fire? Rather than, I don't know, getting some hot water and pouring it on the lock? Oh, oh, what is this doing in here? What? <laughs> Flamethrower, bad idea. Let me just throw that out there. Flamethrower, bad idea. Oh, it's just a rat. Josh, you got rats. It's over here. Ex janitor so convicted. Here? Uh, swears revenge on movie mogul family. Movie mogul, eh? That that does not explain being able to buy a mountain. Actually, I take that back. If the mountain has a sanatorium on it, once again, real estate deal. Oh, I do not like how I don't have control over what I'm seeing. Interesting piece. What's this? Huh. That's cool. Okay, family portrait. Excuse me? Possible ghosty? 
Don't mean to get in your way. I'm just trying to make a makeshift flamethrower. I don't like the whispering in my ear. Hi, Chris. Very funny. Oh, how'd you know it was me? Shouldn't you be, like, getting the lock open or something? On it. I mean, getting the door open is obviously important, but if you guys are that cold, that window is not hard to climb through. Chris, do you not hear things breaking? Wait, wait, wait. That makes sense. You know, power's probably out. What is up with the person-like object in the back. It looks very scarecrow-like. Which, once again, Mr. Analyst, if you're listening, not afraid of scarecrows. I'm supposed to be heading upstairs, right? Upstairs bathroom? I like the antler chandelier. Place has really nice ambiance. What's this? One new message. New message. Hi, Mrs. Washington. This is Sergeant Tate again. It's bad news, I'm afraid. Yeah, we've been through the case files, and there's nothing we can do. He's a free man. We don't have the legal power to restrict his movement. Uh, I know it's not what you wanted to hear, so call me if you want to know more. The janitor? Yeah, messages. Okay. Oh yeah, because he had an arson thing. Oh! And there were like, uh, flames coming out of nowhere in the woods when we were playing as Beth, right? I can hear someone moving around. Prom night. Can I flip it? Ready for senior prom. Excuse me, whoever is stomping around, could you not? I know I'm supposed to go upstairs, but I want to see what else is around here. Looking for anything shiny? Oh wait, I just looked at that, right? No, no, no. Yep, we're going up. Up we go, Chris, my boy. Okay, random window open. just never stops. The ghosts don't want you to feel it alone. See, I told the analyst that I don't like being lonely, so now I'm hearing whispers. Um, this way. Okay, oh, that looks like a bathroom behind me, maybe? So what's, okay, there's, this is not an option. Oh no, it's just a hallway. Oh, my bad. Bathroom! Okay. Ah! 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 
What the fuck? Was oh. that a raccoon or a badger? Freezing our buns off out here. <laughs> the buns, not the buns. Ah. Okay, thank you. Thank you. no thank one you. died. I'll be here all week. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Crap, that thing freaked me out. What was it? Are you okay? It was like a bear or a tiger or something. <laughs> oh, it was just a cute little baby Wolverine. Baby? Don't worry, buddy. You're gonna be a big <gasps> boy soon. Valid reason to be afraid. Wolverines can be quite dangerous, but they are cute. Home sweet home. Sweet is not the word I'd use. Oh my gosh, it's so good to be inside. Even if it's still kind of freezing in here. I'll get a fire going. This place barely looks any different. Yeah, nobody's been up here. Even with all the police coming in and out? N not a lot of action up here lately. Nope. What's up, party people? Hi. Hey. Hey. Hey, man. Make yourself at home, bro. Will do. Oh my god, that is so gross. <laughs> Are you trying to swallow his face whole? Yeah. I mean, seriously, can she be any more obvious? No one wants in on your territory, honey. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me? Was your sluttiness too loud? Sounds like someone's bitter she didn't make the cut. Yeah, it's all a big cattle call with that dream boat. Congrats, you're top cow. Cuts real deep <laughs> calling Miss Homecoming a cow. Oh, I'm mad again? Oh, oh, oh. Uh, I can't go against my girlfriend, Matt. Hey, hey you're making everyone uncomfortable, Jess. Jealous much? Emily too frigid for you too. Hey, that's, that's uncal- Look, whatever. I don't give a crap what you think. At least I can think. 4.0, bitch. On a roll. Suck on that when you're trying to sleep your way into a job. Who needs grades when you've got all the natural advantages you can handle? Oh, please. You couldn't buy a moldy loaf of bread with your skanky ass. Are you serious? Do you think that's insulting? That bitch is on crack or something. <laughs> what is this argument? But you know what? I'm gonna keep provoking. Jessica, <laughs> you need to shut your mouth, okay? No. You're the one who needs to keep your nose out of other people's business. It's I'm my about girlfriend. to get right it's my up business. in your business, you bitch. Are we about to get real? Because I am down to get real. <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> this is not why we came up here. This is not helping. It's not what I wanted. Okay, if we can't get along for 10 minutes, and maybe we need a little bit of a break, right? Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. Yeah, all right. You want to go do that? Any place without that whore. It's right up the trail. <sighs> Glad that's over. Yeah. So, Josh, uh, should we get this fire going? Where's my bag? Huh? My bag, the, the little bag with the pink pattern, the one I got on Rodeo. Matt, are you, are you listening? Oh my god, don't you remember? Next to the Italian shoe place where I got the stilettos and you knocked over the rack while you were drooling all over that girl at the counter? Well, I mean, she was asking about my letter jacket. Right, because she gave a shit about your designer letter jacket. Why do you hate my jacket? Matt, I need my bag. <laughs> oh my god, Em, you, maybe you just forgot it. Do you seriously think I'd forget my bag? Well, do I... Do you? Guess not. You must have left it down by the cable car station. <sighs> Come on, hon. We'll be back soon. And then we can get warm. We can get very warm. Everyone really gonna okay. split up? Okay, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna go take a bath. Good plan, get warm. All right, everyone's just splitting oh, up, apparently. Exiled. Exiled. <laughs> Works for me. Oh, bar. How far is this cabin anyway? This cabin is the coziest, 
the most romantic love den you will ever lay your eyes upon. <laughs> if we ever make it. I have a feeling luck's on our side. Play your cards right and maybe you will get lucky. Hey, porn stars. You're gonna need these. Porn star? I'd pay to see it. Uh, gross. <laughs> Hey, I'm sorry to kick you out like that. No worries, man. Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way to entertain yourselves. Mm-hmm. You have fun with the peanut gallery. <sighs> oh, I almost forgot. Gotta fire up the generator so you can see where you're going. It's dark out there. All right. Roger that. Thank you for adding that. Josh was flirting with me. OK. You want to invite him up with us? <laughs> Wait, really? What? No. All right, y'all really gonna walk all the way out to this cabin when this house is big enough to probably have room for yourselves. Actually, is there more to this little balcony? Hold up. Hold up, Jess, don't run off on your own, please. Okay, I can. Wait, I can. Yeah, come back up here. Okay, sorry Jess, this was a little detour. Little detour and I found nothing. Oh, no, 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 okay. Fixed cameras are a little bit weird to get used to. I don't wanna accidentally keep heading in the wrong direction whenever the camera changes. Oh, what you looking at? Hey, hot lips. Photo booth? All right, read my mind. <sighs> okay. Oh, 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 we gotta get the angles right. Gotta get the angles. Would you guys hold still? Hold, okay, you know what? We're just taking this photo. Oh my God. <laughs> this is perfect. We're like the cutest couple. Damn. You should be a model. You keep that camera handy, and maybe I'll let you start my portfolio at the cabin. <laughs> Noted. Everyone is so obnoxious, but like, I kind of love them. They definitely- Burr, it is freezing out here. Now that's something I can help you with. And how are you gonna do that? Uh, I got a few things in mind. Oh wait, wasn't there? Oh wait, th there was a generator I was supposed to do. Not a lot of with, TLC right? for this place anymore. Kind of a bummer. All right, maybe the generator's further back this way, or maybe not because the path is like right in front of me, right? Emily's as dumb as she looks. If she thinks she can cut in on what we got going on. Maybe if we're lucky, she'll try and follow us out here and get eaten by a bear. <laughs> uh, you know what? We're all for keeping the girlfriends happy. Agree. I think you bring out the worst in her. Is that so? Epic jealousy. Suck it. Yeah, we're all for happy relationships here. Okay, we just agree. Huh. I guess this thing needs juice or something. Oh, didn't Josh say there was a generator? Uh, is it in this creepy building? Oh no, not another totem. I wish you could generate a little excitement about getting that freaking generator to work. I am trying to see the okay, future, I'll, I'll woman. Just yell at it like you're yelling at me. Let's see if that works. <laughs> Okay, what color is this? It's it's danger. That's the color. It's danger. Oh, can I see it again? Hey, Mike. Gonna find the generator or Just what? Just in a second. Oh, wait, wait. I might have to do it from my menu. Uh. Oh no, it was that, right? Status. Okay, Sam looked at Chris's incoming message. Chris was offended by Sam's indiscretion. Uh, Chris criticized Sam for being nosy. 
Okay. Chris chose not to shoot the squirrel. Nature remained balanced. Ashley discouraged Matt from using the telescope. Matt didn't see Mike and Emily flirting. Oh, I guess they were very close. They probably were flirting. Matt was relaxed when Mike and Jessica arrived at the lodge. Emily and Jessica fought. So would they have not fought if Matt had seen? Matt sided with Emily during the fight with Jessica. Yeah, obviously. All right, our relationship with Matt is very low. Makes sense. Oh, I wanted totems, that's what I wanted. Uh, danger. Oh. It looks like Ash gets clocked in the face. Okay. You gotta be careful with All Ashley. Right. Let's see. Down. Boom. Nice one, Mikey. <laughs> you gotta be your own cheerleader, man. If you're not, who's gonna be? Woo! You are a wizard. I'm gonna throw this out there. All of your survival instincts suck. You're telling me that no one gets that feeling in the back of their neck when their hair raises and you're like, oh, I'm kind of being watched right now. Sam, The gates shall open. Pretty good, right? Yeah, totally. That was just Awesome. Oh yeah, I bring the hit. <laughs> what even is that song? You psyched yet? You don't look psyched yet. I am so psyched right now. <laughs> it's like a little adventure, a sexcapade. Wow. Through the freezing forest. This is so much fun. Police? From Hannah and Beth. I think they'd clean it up. Well, they never closed the investigation. Okay, I'm getting the creeps now. Uh, yeah, you probably should. Uh... What do you remember? It's all such a blur. I can barely even remember what happened. Well, what I remember is that we played a stupid half-baked prank that probably got Hannah and Beth killed. Hey, I mean, it's not our fault they ran into the woods. Just a little yeah. bit. How could anyone have expected them to do a dumb thing like that? Oh, like you two right now? I mean, we're currently on a path, so it's a little bit different, but... Still. Oh, no, 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 fix the camera, stop it. Okay. Um, did you hear that? I heard something, yeah. the sound of that. Dang. I don't think we can get up to the cabin with the path block like this. Oh, no way am I going back to the lodge, aka Wax Museum, to drink hot chocolate with Emily. You know what? Fuck it. We're adventurous. We will- ah! Ah! Oh, no. Jess! Fuck! Hey, Jessica! Yep. Hey! I'm okay! Holy crap, you scared the heck out of me. How do you think I felt? Uh, you didn't hit your head or anything. As far as I can tell, I still have all seven of my limbs. <laughs> uh, yeah. Can you get out? I... Uh, I don't know. I can hardly see anything down here. Ah, uh, push the cart. Uh, just jump down. All right, coming after you. If she can just do it, one. you can do it. 
Oh, hey, I was about to get caught. Wanna help me move this cart thing? That is so uncomfortable. You're telling me that you guys went into a mining shaft rather than just jumping over a tree? Alright. Help me move it, help me move it. Yeah, teamwork. Let's go before the murderer jumps down too. I imagined us grunting together. This is not what I pictured. <laughs> All right, can we please walk faster? Jess, you okay? That was a really weird little movement you just did. Not gonna question it, are we? Oh, Nelly. This place is giving me the willies. And not the good kind of willies. Yeah, There's a good you a little comfort and reassurance? <laughs> we'll save it for the cabin, Buster. Wait, wait, wait. If this goes out, I don't wanna... I wanna look. I really don't want to be in the mining shaft for a long period of time, but I do wanna look. Totem. Okay. White. Fortune? That's what we want to happen, right? Oh, it's Jess, but she looks super banged up. And that's fortunate? Mike, Mike, let's get away. Let's, let's go this way. Uh, just don't go that way. No, no, no. Come on. We're, we're going up. We're getting out of the mining shaft. Ooh, I do not like any of this. Okay, so we need to watch... We need to make sure... Just... Something happens... Huh. Ashley can't get clocked Still? in the face. Weird place to have some cigars. <laughs> it's recent. Wonder who's up here. Ooh, that's not creepy at all. Whoa. Oh. This place is like historical. Holy bat cave. It's it's gotta be Native American, right? I don't think the miners were getting their arts and crafts on, no. <laughs> no, no, it's like a shrine or something. A shrine to what? The radio thing in the beginning when Sam was coming towards the mountain said that- <laughs> Oh! You alright? Yeah. Close one. I don't think this place is up to code. Yeah, I'm thinking it's time to go. It said that, um, someone tried to discourage Josh's family from buying this place because it was sacred land, right? Ooh, area's Jesus. at risk. This place is a real fixer-upper. Collapse. Extreme rockfall danger. Okay. Is there anything over here? Looks like there's a little bit of light right there, but maybe not. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I thought I saw a little sparkle above Mike's head. Okay, 
outside. So much better than inside. Another totem! Okay, what do you have in store for me? Okay, so... That... Alright. Ooh, is that Jess? So Jess can die, or she can possibly end up really just banged up, which is preferable to dying, I guess? It's over here. I like how that sign just says cabin. Really helpful. Bedroom. Oh, are you planning on getting presidential on me? Uh, take a ride on Air Force One. <laughs> all right, all right. Save it for the dumb speech. But oh, a telescope! Gonna look at the trees. Gonna look at the clouds. Gonna look at the cabin. Um. Whoa. You all right? I just saw someone at the cabin. Oh, <laughs> let me look. Let me see. Did you not see that? Uh, sampling the old eggnog again, babe? It's just us up here. Uh, maybe. I don't know what that was, but it had eyes. Hey, Jess? Mm-hmm? Stay close by, okay? What's up? Uh... This posting says there's some brown bears up here sometimes. Oh, okay. Michael, I have the best idea. What? Okay, what is it? Let's go hug a bear. Come on, please. Come on. Sounds fun, but Let's they're sleeping right not now. Not hug a bear. Bears hibernate. The wolves might be a concern, though. And elk just sound a lot more scary than what they are. But yeah, bear shouldn't be a problem. scare me that much to be annoyed because the music was building right there. I was just... just answering his meeting. <laughs> wow, you're easy. Yeah, got a lot of love to give. <laughs> <He's> scared. <laughs> scared. He whispers that part to himself. Yeah, the music building kind of gave that one away. says <sighs> God damn it Josh can you have at least cleared out the path before sending us up here 
really? What? I didn't figure you for the glass half empty type. You got a better idea? Stand back, Hop Debbie Downer. It. Oh, yeah, see? Boo. Show off. Hey, Mike. You've got something on your face. Ah. Boo! Okay. Okay. Well, that's how yeah, it's going to be. Yeah, she... Good idea. Or not. Yes. Yes. I was gonna congratulate her for just jumping over the obstacle, but um Debbie! I think she got yanked. What? You wanna help me get this fire going? Uh well, I was just getting into the bath. Oh. Oh, do you need any help with that? Hardy R. Come on. All right, Josh, let's see if you know how to hook up the hot water in your big fancy lodge. All right, we need hot water. What else is around here? I should be a lot more concerned that Jessica just got yanked into the abyss. Are you hearing stuff too? Josh, Beth, you were invited to Sam's Halloween party. Fancy dress, okay. Oh! I, I don't like that. I don't like how that's the postcard that we were shown. Uh, okay, tattoo artist. Okay, because I did see that the one with the glasses had a little... She had a butterfly tattoo. In that one scene before, uh, she went missing and I accidentally dropped her off a cliff. <gasps> All Hannah stuff. Ah, oh, music box. Massive room, then again, the massive house. Okay, party, dear Hannah. Gee, Hannah, crush oh. much? Okay, a little bit creepy. Oh, wait, I want to look at the other points in the board. Okay, she has a little sticky note with Josh on it. Horses, looks like concert tickets. M and HW. Compatibility test. Okay. Oh no, this is not going to work. He's he's like a crazy, reckless hunk of man staying at home working on your Oh my god, stop moving it, Sam. Embroidering practicing G minor on the piano. Okay. Anything to attract his precious attention. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Run away from home or get a tattoo to attract his attention. She really went and got a butterfly tattoo because of a compatibility quiz? Oh, Hannah. Oh, oh sweetheart. How old are these people? Okay, I just looked at that. I'm making a guess between, like, 16... Maybe to 19 because of, like, the year gap. 
If they are any older, then this is just kind of sad. Is that everything in this room? Okay, this was Hannah's room. Where's Beth's room? I want to snoop there too. Got caught on something. Oh, oh, I'm still caught on something. <laughs> okay. Can I wiggle my way through here? Or is this just a no-go? Okay, I don't think I was meant to go this way. way to just open that door. Alright, I have to go this way. Come on. I won't be a single day if you want to my money on blankets for everyone. You can do it, man. We believe in you. <laughs> yeah, totally. Woohoo! Let's go, Josh. Let's go. What else is around here? Locked. Alright, they have succeeded in lighting fire. Alright, peanut gallery, you know what? I got an idea for you two. What? Okay, well, I'm pretty sure that somewhere in this crazy place we used to have a spirit board. Oh, oh no, no. Wow, you have a spirit board? <laughs> yeah, yeah, they're fun, right? Those things no, are a joke, not. man. They don't do shit. No way, bro. I mean, we used to do it all the time, me and... Well... Hey, Josh, no hot water's kind of major oversight, don't you think? Yeah. Ooh, yeah, you just gotta fire up the boiler. It's in the basement. All right, you guys, see if you can find the spirit board. Chris, or don't. let's go find it. It'll be like a scavenger hunt. Um... Okay. Guess so. Brad. You're not gonna regret it. You up for a ride along? I am too superstitious for the Ouija board nonsense. Absolutely not. Whoever finds it, you're sleeping outside with it. You're not bringing it in the main living area where I have to be. Did Emily and Matt go? I just thought that, Notice oh, how yeah, I gave bad. Chris and Ash a mission together. Yeah, I was thinking they could use some alone time. Ah, uh, flattering. They are very sweet together. I wish they'd just freaking get on with it already. I swear, they just need like something to bond over you know some sort of traumatic event to send them into each other's arms i mean at this rate they'll be in the geriatric ward before chris makes a move <laughs> oh my friends aren't getting together let's hope they trauma bond over something interesting um okay josh and the twins josh with his lovely sisters hannah beth looking great guys Josh has definitely, like, been through some stuff in this past year because he keeps adding on the weirdest comments to, like, the very end of his sentences. Hold up, Josh. I'm checking out your house. Sam is very nosy. You know, Sam. Yes, Josh? I just wanted to say... What? It really means a lot to me that everyone came back this year and, you know, that you came, Sam. Uh, let's be reassuring. Josh, we're here for you. Really, whatever you need, whenever, we're all gonna make it through this. Together. Um, 
I want us to have a good time, you know? Why is the music like that? Hey, watch your step. I think I can handle a little old set of stairs. Mm -hmm. Sorry to drag you down into the bow. Oh, just get me some hot water and I'll be super fine. I mean, I wouldn't want you coming down here on your own, you know? Well, it's <laughs> definitely creepy down here. Yep. Not a place to be on your own. You say the wildest things. Ooh. It's a bat. Uh, humorous. Be pretty rough playing baseball out in all that snow. No, it, it wasn't in the winter, silly. I mean, we'd come up in the summer and we would have the best time. The whole family was there. Mom, Dad, my sisters. It was some serious competition out there on the big lawn. I don't know. Can't go back. New reality, right, Sam? Anyway, I'm supposed to be fixing this old guy, right? All right, that was important. Why was it important? Sam found a baseball bat and left it in the cellar. Was I supposed to bring it with me? Jessica appreciated Mike's heroism. Here, can you, can you hold this? What was that? What was what? Just shine it here so I can see what I'm doing. There's no way you didn't hear that. Hey, oh, can you just keep bad. the light okay. so I can see, okay? That was my bad. I thought I had to like re-level the controller, but apparently not. I just leave it where it is. Stop moving. Stop moving. Nice one. Okay, first things first. We gotta increase the water pressure before we get the boiler fired up. Mm, sounds kind of complicated. No, it's actually pretty simple. Okay. It's okay. I'm just try again. Okay. Oh, I don't have to move it. Oh, God. That's more like it. <laughs> All right. Five, girl. Mm. Yeah. I almost missed that. Can't leave him hanging. Can't not give a high five. trip you and leave you in the cellar with whatever's in here. Oh, something behind you? Oh my god. Don't move. What? Nothing behind you. <laughs> yeah, right. Ah, uh, I don't want to freak out the weird guy with the dead sisters. Didn't get him, Sam. I was not. You were too. Honey, you're gonna have to do a whole lot better than that to freak me out, all right? Wait, okay, so you can hear that too, right? Josh. 
what? Carson is like weirdly regular. Not, not, nothing regular about it. Uh, we should, we should check it out. Maybe we should you know, check it out. Why? With the baseball bat. What if it's like a, a pipe that's about to burst or some problem with the furnace? Unlikely. If it were me, I wouldn't want this place to burn down on my watch. Yeah, right. Why are you standing aside? Why do I have to go first? Oh! Oh! What the hell? Oh, no, 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 no. Crip Josh. Oh, God. Is this one of the... To keep out strangers! Hey. What? Hey. What the hell? Ooh, you just got mumped. What? <laughs> nice. I hate you. Nice one. That was good. Wait, but why would you do that? There's all this cool old movie crap down here. What was I? Was I not supposed to take advantage of the opportunity? Are you? Are you serious? <laughs> Were you in on this, putz? <laughs> no, but I, I wish I was. That was too good. Oh, he wasn't? Okay. <laughs> That's ridiculous. I'm Him tripping. Your dumb little prank may have a slight whiff of humor. Joke master. Well, I, I said nothing about jokes. I said your prank, which was dumb. Holy crap, you were scared. Admit it. I was not. Come on, you totally pissed yourself. Josh. <laughs> What in God's name are you wearing? I found my true calling. Mm -hmm. Please tell me you're gonna take a vow of silence. <laughs> okay, okay, did you at least find the thingy? Oh no, did, no. Wait, 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 wait. Where were you Here's hiding that? Here's ticket to the spirit realm. Ooh. You know what, you know what, no. no. I've yes. just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. Yep. All right, so have fun. Oh, but watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Okay. And if any demons answer your call, they're taking you first. I will negotiate. I'm not dealing with this. I would like to understand your feelings toward people of fear, isolation, Loneliness. Do you share this fear? Oh, okay. See, I could deal with the, the beating heart on the table. Why'd you put a tarantula there? Sir, you're making me not like you. Uh, doesn't everyone have a little bit of an issue with isolation? Is that so? Because... That's not reflected in the way you are playing your game, now is it? Wait, what? I think I missed the question because of the spider. And now, let us investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. What you value? What you respect in yourself and others? Which would you say was most important in a person? Loyalty or honesty? Oh, oh. Okay, why is the spider looking at me like that? Um. Oh, this is a rough one. Uh. Probably honesty, right? I I'm saying right rhetorically because obviously I'm the only one that can answer this question. Spider, if you look at me one more time, I'm throwing you at him. So, you would tell the truth, even if it resulted in an unpleasant outcome for a friend. And what about honesty Probably. Then? And charity? Uh, still with... Uh, 
Okay, random car alarm from the game. <laughs> Charity is overrated, I suppose. Better to be true to yourself than to help others in need, eh? That's not what I said. Oh. Once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. gonna have to stop here I am thoroughly enjoying this I do kind of like the little psychoanalyst sessions I'm not quite sure what they mean obviously he brought my fears to the table I don't really have a problem with gore so that was not the problem but the spider was unnecessary but yeah I am thoroughly enjoying this also I noticed that like each segment seems to be paced out to exactly an hour or almost there so I guess you actually are getting like a countdown until dawn because I noticed when we first came up it was 11 hours until dawn and now it's 10 or maybe it was 10 and now it's 9. But I do like that it kind of paces it out for me. But um, I'm going to end this off here. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode and I hope you join me again and I'll be seeing you very soon. Bye.